Today we're having a session on promising models and partnerships to build better community health. Today we're talking about the Build Health Challenge. It's a partnership that brings together hospitals, communities, and public health agencies to really push us upstream. Because what we realize is that given that kind of 80% of our health outcomes are dictated by education, housing, transportation, those social determinants, that we need to make a, a move from trying to achieve health through pills and procedures to policies and partnerships. That's the vaccine that we need. So it's harder than just coming to get something out of a laboratory, but it's really what's gonna help us moving forward. So when you think about some of the barriers that we have in public health, I think data really are our biggest challenge. We have uh, an entire movement towards precision medicine, where we need to get down to our genetics to understand how medicine will work better in us. Yet, when you look at the data that we have available for our communities, it's tantamount to using leeches. So when you really look at what we have on the medical side versus the data we have in our communities, that's what we need, better data. And it's there. It's in the $27 billion investment we've made in electronic health records. And so if we can access those data to get you know, geographically specific, real-time data, we can start making differences in the lives of people. But if we don't have the data, we can't do that. So when you think about APAJ, this is such kind of a melting pot of ideas and different perspectives. And this is where the, it's, it's the crucible of the ideas that are gonna change our whole lives. And that's what APAJ is important. That's why it's something we always wanna to come to. And we wanna share our experiences so that people can comment, we can hone our messages, and we can really have impact.